Oh, you gotta watch this. Wait, don't don't go in the house yet. Why not? Hey, listen. Oh, go, go on to the. Just go sit on the porch. Hey, listen. What do you think you're doing? I'm dropping them off. For good. Listen. I met a younger guy. And oh he don't want no God. kids. Oh and he don't want to. Listen. He don't want to deal with them. And so I'm dropping these kids off so me and him can live our life. We want to travel. We want to explore the world. And I can't do oh that with kids. My God. I can't. I cannot believe. It's time for me to be happy. And I just want to be happy and stress-free without these children. That's all I want. Then you should ask me, baby. I shouldn't have to ask. You are the grandparent. It's respect, Angel. It's respect. Well, I hope that you respect my decision on moving on my life with my new man and no kids. I'm not raising your kids. Well, I'm not either. Well, I, I don't know what to tell you because I'm not doing it. I'm just letting you know right now I'm not doing it. These are your three tired. kids. I'm tired. I'm tired of being a single parent. I'm tired. But you... When you have children, they become your number one priority. The one that laid down and made the decision to have three kids. That is not my responsibility. And this is the last time you're going to do this. You're not doing it anymore. It's your responsibility, not mine. Well, it wasn't, it was not my plan to be no single parent. Well, it's not my plan to be a grandmother that's going to take care of somebody's three kids because they feel like they're not responsible anymore, that they don't want to be a mother anymore either. Well, look, I, I just can't. I can't do this no more. I'm tired. I'm overwhelmed. I'm stressed. It's depressing. I can't do it. But you're going to have to do it. Do you understand that you're going to have to do this? Well, I don't want to. Okay, but I can't. Do you understand that I'm not going to take care of your children? I'm not getting ready to raise three kids. Look, do you know how old I you never oh taught me how to be a mom. You didn't tell me what to do. You didn't help me. So now it's your turn. You take your grandkids so I can live my life stress-free. Okay, but the reason that I could not teach you how to be a mother, Angel, is because I was working a full-time job. You have to understand that the majority of the time, our parents did the best they could with what they had. We may not feel like we got everything we wanted, but look, some of our parents worked two jobs. Some of our parents had to do the impossible. So let's take it easy on them. That's not my problem. I cannot. I'm not. Just hear me out when I say I'm not, not going to take That's care of your three kids that you had because you're disrespectful. You just come over here and just drop them off. I have to ask you to watch your grandchildren. No, you're not talking about watching. You just told me I was going to have to raise them. I have to ask you to raise your grandchildren. Oh, my God. They're your grandchildren. Oh, it's my your responsibility. I, I can't even believe I'm hearing this from you right now. I cannot believe that you actually think that I'm supposed to say it's okay that I'm just going to just give up my life, my freedom. To raise three kids and not even mine, I raised you all. And that's all I'm going to do. I'm not I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. So you can forget that. I'm not doing it. You did not raise us. Uh, what you? And I'm not raising mine. So it's your responsibility now. So if you don't mind, oh, I can boy. just drive off. You raise your grandchildren. You can do it better than I can. I can't do it. I want you to hear me when I say this. I hear you, but I, I am not raising your three kids. I am not keeping them today. I'm not keeping them tomorrow. Matter of fact, this is all your responsibility from this point on. You should have thought about that after you had the first one and then the second one. And then you, now you got three. Hey, girl, bye. You I'm, had I'm, three. I'm, 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 yeah, well, you and I raised three. all three of y'all. You did not. Yes, I did. You didn't. You, you had everything that you wanted. I was right there to teach and instill you. I don't even know where this attitude is coming from. I didn't raise you like this, Angel. Okay, well, listen. Being a single parent will make you angry, mad, upset, and stressed, and everything above, and I am tired. But you cannot come over here and drop those children off and think that I'm supposed to say, yes, I'm going to do it because I'm not. Now, uh, look, uh, hey, hey. Yeah, There's no point in you telling them to get back in the car because they're not coming I, with me. I'm not, I'm not. Why is all this going on in front of the children? They see you. They hear you. Wow. Come, come, on, come, on, nope. come on here. Yo, come on and get in this car. They're not coming. I'm, I'm, I'm not. For what? Hey, what is the point of them getting in back in the car? I'm, I'm not. I'm well, not. I'm not either, so. Yeah, get in, get in the car here. Oh, my God. Come on here. Get in the car. Grandma loves you. Love you too. All right, and I'll see you later. Uh -huh. Angel, um, uh-uh, yeah.
We're done talking. We're done. You can go now. You can go now. Go on and pull off. I don't know what you're sitting here for. Out. Don't get, get out. out of my don't car. get out. What? What on, in the world? Get out. Hey, 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 look. Oh my God. No she. Yeah, get out. Hey, 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 Angel. Hey, Angel, what? What is. No, this chick did. Oh my God. Wow. I can't wait to hear your thoughts on this. First, she was very disrespectful, and I understand it is tough being a single parent. But like your mom said, it was tough after the first child. It was tough after the second one. Then you went and had a third baby. So it's three times as hard. Yes, you're going to have some good days, and you're going to have some bad days, but you press on. We got to start asking for help. That's why we say it takes a village. Yeah, we make mistakes, but ask for help when you need help. Don't get to this breaking point to where you just like, I'm done. And go attempt to drop your children off. They see this. They hear you. How do you think they feel? I would feel so unwanted, so unloved if I was those children. Our main goal is to protect our children by any means necessary. As grandparents, we're there to help. We're there to aid. If anything happens to you, then that's when we take on full responsibility. But those are your babies. You birthed them. You had them. They're your responsibility. Drop your comments. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, follow. You know what to do. Let's get this conversation going. Let's go.